Can't talk to these people about money if I look like money. You dig? Uh. <laughs> All right. All right, hi everybody. Welcome back to my channel. All right, boom. So, quick video about how I pay for college at Howard University. You know, how I pay my tuition without assistance. No scholarship, no grant. Not saying that I don't want any, just in case, you know, somebody wants to help a struggling acting major get through college. Email me. <laughs> but this is really just a little how to get started thing. Boom. First things first, very obvious. This is not cute. First things first, very obvious. Get a job. Never had a job before. Get a job. Anyways. The, the school offers, you know, on-campus work. So, you know, when you're filling out your FAFSA, hopefully, you know, if you're already coming to Howard HU21, whatever, or whatever school that you're going to, hopefully, you know, you clicked on, you know, um, what's it called? Campus working, work, whatever. You know, you know what, you know, you know what I'm talking about. On camp, whatever. On-campus working, that sort of thing, yeah? Good. Because I know for Howard, I think, I believe you know it, ta it starts at like $12 an hour and $12 an hour 20 hours a week you know it adds up and it can go towards your tuition as far as my situation how my situation is set up $47,000 a year that's Howard right boom I don't live on campus so that cuts out half of the price so Howard this is the price me not living on campus this is all I really have to focus on I take out the subsidized and the unsubsidized student loan do I want to no I don't but I really want to go to Howard it's my dream school so I'm doing it because you know I walk by faith not by sight and I know that very soon I'll be able to pay it off so I'm not even worried about that um and I've been paying my tuition out of pocket for two years I'm going into my third year still doing still doing the same thing have I been applying to scholarships yes I have just so y'all know I was a top five finalist in the Beyonce formation scholarship anyways <laughs> anyways let's just move on I'm still a little scarred but now, you know but that was her blessing that's my belief, you know. You don't want it. That's somebody else's blessing. Yours is on the way. Boom. Um, but you know, back to the job, back to working. I work all the time. Does that mean I can't enjoy school? No, it doesn't. Does that mean I have to make sacrifices at times? Yes, it does. I do most of my work and most of my saving during the big breaks. So like summer holidays, currently I have a job. You know, I'm using that to pay for um, fall semester coming up. You know, winter break, if I'm not traveling or something, I make sure to have a job. Um, last summer was like the big one. I worked at Walmart as an overnight cashier. I hated it every millisecond of it but you know what it paid me some good money I did it for three months 40 hours a week those that three months and I made more than enough to pay what I pay out of pocket out of pocket I pay about four thousand dollars call it that and I made that and so you understand so I was able to pay for fall tuition and then you know what I worked during the school year that fall i saved up and paid for spring semester you understand so you know if you think about it think about it in pieces don't think about the whole thing break it down i really think that's like a good thing to do to help you get to to get there is if you don't think about the 47 thousand. think about spring semester fall semester you understand and I really think that makes a difference to me 
I'm making this video really and truly because I don't think that money should be a deciding factor on whether or not you follow your dreams. I just never thought like that and I never wanted to think like that. I thought I was only going to spend two years at Howard. Turns out I had to spend four because I'm a theatre arts major with a concentration in acting and my department is a, a mandatory four-year training program. So I had to spend the extra two years. And you know what? At, at one point I was like, but do I want to spend this? I don't got the money for that. And I said, am I going to let money, pieces of paper, stop me from following my dreams? <laughs> never have, never will. So that's one thing. Another thing that you can do, you know, other than having a job, really and truly, hustle. If you know how to do hair, if you know how to do makeup, if you know how to do nails, whatever you know how to do, turn that into money. Almost everybody at Howard has like a side hustle. You understand? Do you pray? If, if another thing is whatever your religion is, whoever you believe in, pray, have faith, talk to them. But I am a Christian. I walk by faith, not by sight. I believe I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And when I tell you that he has made a way for me, I'm just saying. So please don't let money stop you from going to the school of your dreams. It's possible. If you have any more questions or something like that, something I did not cover, you know, Feel free to comment, let me know, and I'll address it. At DM me on Instagram or Twitter or whatever. I will talk to you if it's something that you're going through, you know, you and your parents, and you really want to figure out how I really, really, really do it besides these few little facts and hints, you know, let me know and I will gladly, I will gladly share my not so secret secrets eh, with you about it because I do believe that it is possible to pay your tuition. Still apply for scholarships, apply to all the scholarships, apply to money is out there i'm still applying child honey let me tell you but just make sure say it yeah it is possible it is possible to follow your dreams don't let money stop you you understand exhaust all the resources before you say okay i can't do it let me go find something cheaper but do not stop exhausting your resources you understand It's possible.